there YouTube, I'm back again for another unboxing video and today I'm going to be unboxing Letter Jam from CGE, which I got to tell you, this is one of my favorite games of 2019, so now that I got my hands on it, I'm super excited, chomping at the bits to check it out because um, I think it might be the best word game I've ever played in my life, to be honest with you. It, it is that stinking good. Two to six players, ages 10 plus, 45 minutes to play. Your friend gives you this clue. Can you guess your secret? That's right. It's obviously an F. Wafer. Unless it's a G. Or would your friend think a word like wafer is a good clue? Okay, so they actually <laughs> they played on exactly what I was saying there. So what do we got? We have these. These pencils? These unsharpened pencils? Come on. Come on. Tell me they're not unsharpened. They're unsharpened pencils with no erasers? Dirty. Do they conclude a sharpener? Oh, come on, man. CG. I need, a, I need a sharpener. That's a little bit disappointing, but the game itself is spectacular, so I really don't care that much about it. And there's a sharpener! Oh my gosh, I take it all back. In fact, now I actually am happier that this came with unsharpened pencils, because now I can sharpen other pencils. Booyah! Letter Jam might be my 2019 game of the year, and the only game of my entire career, which is thousands of videos, that included a pencil sharpener. So big ups to CGE right there. Huge. That went from a negative to a positive. We got this little score sheet, which I wish was double-sided. I don't see why it couldn't be double-sided as long as the paper is a little bit thicker. Uh, but yeah, you can print more of these off. And this is incredibly useful in helping you figure it out. I'm not going to try and explain it to you. But once you learn how to play the game, this thing is just absolutely essential. Oh, oh, heft, heft. Those are, those are poker chips. Yeah, feel that. Hear that. You can't feel it, but I can like I can help you feel it by letting you hear it. Let's see. Oh, these are oh oh just mm, naughty. Spanking these chips, man. These are thick, hefty chips, double sided. Booyah! They didn't they they might have spared a couple expenses going on the notepad, but man, they did not scare the expenses going on these chips. Oh, those feel good. Very slick. Like them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We got these doodads, and I'm actually really excited to see these components because when I played the game, it was a prototype version of it at Origins 2019. Uh, so yeah, these are perfectly fine little uh, things. I like the colors on them, and yeah, you know what tokens look like. I don't know why I took this out. Let's see, we got these, which are going to be utilized to hold up the cards. Ow! 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 That really hurt my <laughs> finger. So these are very sturdy. Um, yeah, nice. Good. Let's, of course, we need to test them out, put a card in it. So these aren't the actual cards that are going to be going into it, but... Oh yeah, look at that. Uh, look at this. Give it a shake. Get out! Okay, it finally got out when I went in a particular direction, but with most normal usage not coming out. Look at that. Like, that's the right angle, too. I'm going down to try and get it out. And look at that. Very nice. Leave much of a mark. Not too much of a mark either. Let's let's see. Oh, very nice. I'm gonna guess these are for the solo version of the game, which you absolutely can bet your. Oh, there is no solo version of the game. Those are for the different uh, versions of the game. Oh, this is what goes in the middle. Ah, uh, this is what you're gonna be putting these guys on. I was hoping there's a solo version of the game. I just got my hopes up. I knew there wasn't because I saw the side of the box. Let's. And then what do we have here? We got a couple of things. So this is the big book of CGE, which a lot of good games in there. Letter Jam, which rules overview video on the first page. I'm always a big fan of that. Uh, we got ourselves three, four, five, six, seven, eight pages. Very nice. Frequently asked questions in the back. Always very useful. Always very useful. Nobody wants to grab the rule book and start looking through rules. But if you just have this sitting back, let's say, oh, well, frequently asked questions. Very nice. But let's check out these cards and put them into the stands. And struggle amazingly with this. I would like to make a compilation of people just struggling to open cards with stupid little things. That one was actually pretty good though. So big thumbs up, CG. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That is whoo! Look at the quality on that. That is so nice. That makes me really wonder 
why this is double-sided because I'm looking at everything and I'm saying this thing hurt my finger so no cost ex you know they're, they're spending money on that these chips are as nice chips as you're gonna find in any game you know nice looking rule booklet it's got the dual staple I don't know what that means but it sounds impressive good looking rule booklet full color they printed this thing off too which is very nice you know that that's not cheap that's not cheap to make a lot of these you know these these are these are these are serviceable i mean these might be the second weakest component that i'm feeling here but i mean honestly it's just going to sit in a stand and you're going to look at it so i really doesn't need to be anything durable you know so that really makes this a little bit more glaring i don't know why this isn't double-sided that's a little bit annoying uh but these cards look at that look at that that is just oh and you can feel it too it's got it raised up on the outside very nice looking cards. I'm not sure what that's about. I'm wondering if that's some sort of braille thing. Obviously, you can't feel the cards. I'm a moron. Some sort of other thing. Or maybe it's just symbology. Who knows? I'm sure they'll cover it in the rules. Um, maybe it's for the... Uh, the. Ooh, yeah, feels good. Uh, so overall, there you go. That is Letter Jam from CGE. The unboxing of this got me even more excited to play the game. Because it came in with a pencil sharpener. And what more could you possibly want in life than a pencil sharpener? It's essential. You should have a pencil sharpener in your house. And if you do not have a pencil sharpener in your house, you're like, dang it. Why don't I have a pencil sharpener in my house? But there you go. Letter Jam CGE, a cooperative word game. It looks like it might become a tea. Be sure to check that one out. If you're enjoying what I'm doing, please consider hitting the subscribe button down below. Don't ring the bell for dear God, because I post so many weird, crazy out there videos. I would not suggest to anyone to ever ring the bell. Or if you want to consider supporting the Patreon, consider doing that, because it really does help out the channel. That's in the links below. And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube.